Soon Harry was sent to the hospital, the insect was crawling in his thighs. The doctor recommended immediate amputation, but Harry didn't agree at all. Suddenly the insect turned around and crawled towards the middle of the legs, asking the doctor to amputate the leg immediately. But by now the insect has penetrated into the large intestine. The doctor quickly applied enema for Harry, picked up the plier and pinched the insect out of his body. After a few seconds exposed to oxygen, the insect suffocated and died. But the story didn't end yet. Since the meteorite fell, mysterious creatures began to appear near the crater. Some appeared in residents' homes, some even attacked innocent residents, but they all had a fatal flaw. Could only survive in the presence of oxygen for a few minutes. However, it made the two very panic. Because the creatures they found were different every time, meant that the creatures were evolving at the same time. Not far from the crater, they found a group of suffocating dragons. Suddenly a dragon slowly got up, spitting out an embryo from the mouth. Immediately a baby dragon was born. But the scary thing was this dragon has evolved to adapt to oxygen. Before they could react the dragon has already flown towards the downtown. Soon the dragon crashed in the mall. Just a few minutes its body size has doubled. The three quickly